So there are many patients who can really benefit from uh, radio frequency ablations of thyroid nodules. Um, so we can start with benign nodules. If you have patients with a large thyroid mass that causing some compressive symptoms, difficulty swallowing, difficulty breathing, change in voice, or neck discomfort, um, we can control this with radio frequency ablation instead of doing an operation to remove the thyroid mass. Um, if we have uh, nodules that are suspicious on uh, uh, on ultrasound but are benign on the biopsy and maybe they are enlarging in size and the patient like to have some intervention instead of doing an operation, radio frequency ablation can help here. Hyperactive nodules is a great indication for radio frequency ablation. So these patients will have hyperthyroidism, hyperactivity, too much thyroid hormones coming out of the thyroid gland. And instead of doing an operation to remove, for example, half the thyroid gland, we just burn the nodule and a patient can keep their thyroid gland. So the key here that with any of these procedures, when we burn the nodule, the patient maintain the thyroid gland and this does not affect their thyroid function test and uh, the functionality of the thyroid gland. Um, with experience, this can be used for cancer too. There is uh, good data out there in the utilization of uh, radiofrequency ablation for thyroid cancer and for metastatic disease for patients who um, have metastatic lymph nodes are not good candidates for an operation. And there is definitely a rule for this with a good data to show um, very uh, reasonable outcome on these patients.